best way to stay a step ahead of your opponent in jiu-jitsu. Most people, as they get a little older, they play a more passive weight, let them do stuff, counter, counter. I like to stay one step ahead. And how do you stay one step ahead? Attack first. Attack aggressively, attack often. So let me tell you an example. If I want to stay a step ahead, he's on his butt and I'm passing. If I were to come in and just kind of see what he does, he's going to put me in some kind of a lacing, either that, or he's going to go into a De La Hiva, or he's going to go into a reverse De La Hiva, and he's going to start an attack on you. So if he's on his butt, instead of me just coming in and going and waiting for him, I'm going to do something more like this. And I threw his legs to the side. He has to now react to that instead of attack me, instead of sweep me. I'm one step ahead, it's a slow motion. So if I throw his legs to the side, and I start to pass, he's got to bring his legs back fast. And then I bring him back this way, and now he's got to bring them back. And now I start bringing the knee cut through. He's got to defend the knee cut through. At what point in time could he attack me or sweep me? It's going to be really hard. There's counters he can do, of course, but it's going to be really hard for him to attack me when he's a step behind me. I'm aggressive in my game. Some people, their personalities equal their jujitsu. I guess I'm pretty aggressive personality, and I'm going to always be on the attack first. If someone's on the attack first on me, I'm going to defend quick, and I'm going to go right back to the attack so that I'm always one step ahead, and they're always one step behind, and you'll have more success that way. For more philosophy, and strategies like this, check out my BJJ Philosophy Blueprint. Type in philosophy in the comments and I'll send you a link to the course.